Hey everybody, it's Keisha Koo here. I thought y'all would love to see this one. We need a good laugh. This is uh. <laughs> y'all know who that is, don't y'all? Richard Sim Sim Simmons. I found this uh, Jim and Timmy Faye Baker. They used to have some fun on their show. Gotta make everybody a little happy today. <laughs> hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. You know what? what? You Christians sure do put away a lot of food. <laughs> now everybody turn this way. Everyone turn this way. Face this wall. Okay. Put your hands like this. <laughs> Elbows high. Sir, are you chewing gum up there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, not a gum chewer. Because oh, if he chews gum, gum, he'll spit in that woman's hair oh, over there. Oh, my gosh. You got gum he in your mouth? Go Don't you lie to me. Give me that gum. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> he got the gum. Tammy. I don't know how I caught that one. He told me no, he took this other side of his mouth. All right, give me that music again. Hands up. All right, all I want you to do is squeeze those buttons. Here we go. Squeeze. 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 All right, turn away the other side. Other side. Somebody's in trouble for sure. She acts like she's never squeezed before. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Elbows up. Elbows up like this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're going to bring, you know, you got the water park coming and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. But we're going to start having large exercise classes here. <laughs> right here at Heritage. What do y'all think about that? Big classes. I never knew that. If, I know y'all was, a lot of y'all was probably born before I was. I was born in 1982. Y'all probably remember the, this. I said was buffet. If anybody watches this, and they was... Just for the food. That was, was probably about. Was remember this? Yes. So Comment below. Wait, let's talk about me. This is some fun, oh, some I fun uh, televangel, so te tele uh, so evangelist TV, right here. Now you know that you know if when you die, yeah. before you go to heaven, yeah. you have to go to an exercise studio in purgatory. <laughs> <laughs> so all those pounds are off. When Richard picked me up, I said, oh, I sure am glad I got thin hips. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> well, last night she called me. She was shoving guacamole in her mouth. <laughs> That's right. That's a thing about church people. They do like to eat on Sundays and after church. Putting down the fork. I mean, the easiest thing for people to do is eat. Right, guys? Yeah. yeah. I want to know how many of you all exercise at least Four hours a week. Put your hands up. Shoot, I, I, I don't. I need to, we though. We got a lot of work to do. <laughs> <laughs> well, see, so long, the church people, a lot of the church people didn't have anything to do but eat. That was our main That's, that's what, yeah. We're going to get aerobic choirs. Tammy, <laughs> you see all those, see this one right here? See this guy right here? He's aerobic here. choirs, y'all. <laughs> Oh my God! That would get that would get so everybody to go to church on Sunday, wouldn't it? <laughs> get a workout too. Oh my goodness! <laughs> we're gonna get him pissed in, and then we're gonna do all religious music and do big exercise classes. Oh, I think that'd be great. I like to exercise. <laughs> Damn I like to exercise. We, did new and it's, um, we just opened the very She's first such a exercise sweetheart. studio for the handicapped. 
in Los Angeles, California. Oh, that's so sweet. Y'all, it's just so sad. I want to put a happy moment up here. It's just so sad. You know, this whole situation. I found out so much more as I've been doing more research into this, and I'm going to upload another video. Try to do it in a little bit. history of the world of publishing, and every dime of my royalty goes to build these exercise studios for people with polio, spina bifida, cystic fibrosis. Isn't that awesome? We don't. I so hard was concerned about. They had the so many right. people that was jealous of their ministry. Right now. You know where the word handicap comes from? When the crippled people years ago, they called them crippled, which I hate that word. I do too. On the street and they take off their cap because it was so oh. easy to put the money in. Well, I didn't know that. Came. We call these people. We don't use the word disabled. We don't That's use the right. word handicapped. We use the word people with physical challenges. That's right. Because we all have challenges. We Everybody sure do. Has Everybody has a challenge. You know, Richard, so many times. You're dressed like a cheerleader today. <laughs> <laughs> get loose here a little bit. It's hard for me. <laughs> 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 Sylvester Stallone, Sylvester Stallone has an autistic child. And oh. I had never met him except once in the Mike Douglas I didn't show know that. Did y'all know that Sylvester Stallone had an autistic right. child? I didn't but know Sylvester that. Sylvester has an autistic child, and we got 100 doctors and 300 physical therapists to help us write this book. That's wonderful. And the video comes out in June with Linda Evans, Jane Whoa. Fonda. You know what? What? My friend, I have a very good friend yeah. whose name is Joan Rivers. Oh, yes. And she wants you to come do her new show. Would you come oh, do her I'd new show? Oh, I'd love to. Y'all, Tammy Faye, they work so hard in this ministry. Look at all those people. Tammy will bring a bar of stuff and say, Joan, put this in your mouth. <laughs> no, she, she is chairperson of Cystic Fibrosis, Joan Rivers, and she has raised millions of dollars. She's a good lady, and you two together. She is a good lady. Great. Have a great time. I'll hey, do it. This is my show. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he wouldn't have a show unless it was Tammy Faye. There wouldn't be no show without Tammy Faye, baby. But you know, both of them together, they complemented each other. You know, because he was more mellow, kind of. Well, sometimes loud, and Tammy Faye was quiet but funny. Mainstream of society. Three groups of people. Wrong. Three groups of people have been rejected. <laughs> That's all Jim Baker knows is the ministry, y'all. <laughs> the senior citizen. He's still doing it to this day, but that's challenge. all he knows. We're going to change that. We're going to wipe <laughs> off the word senior citizen and call people silver citizens. Yay! Silver citizens. Richard, I... I don't know if this is true. If I, I have any silver citizens that happen to subscribe or happen to watch us, comment down below. Silver citizens. Refused to carry this book of Richard Simmons because handicapped people were pictured. I mean, handicapped, physically challenged. Physically challenged, yeah. Showing people in wheelchairs was depressing, so I got my buns over to the big bookstore and I brought 200 people in wheelchairs. Isn't that something? And I said, hi. How the heck are you? Oh, That's right. And man, you never saw so many books go in a window. When you have someone who's negative, the only force that you can help is with the positive That's force. right. That's so right. When you have 200 people with spina bifida and MS and Alzheimer's yes. and cystic fibrosis. And I know how that is because I have a, a brother-in-law that has, has a physical too. handicap, but he We're don't let that overcome me. He gets challenge. up and he goes to church Everybody every here. Sunday. Everyone here has some doubts about their life, but bottom line is if you're positive, and you believe in yourself. That's right. You good attitude. You get the keys to anything you want. That's right. Sure. Sure. Just stay positive. And push sure. through everything. Come from 268 pounds to become the guru of physical fitness. He won four <laughs> Emmy awards. Jimmy oh, Baker. Jimmy Baker. Like <laughs> you know. So I mean, he is a you can make it. Look, and I think that's Jim like Baker's son sta you know, standing right there by him when he was young tomorrow. on the right. <laughs> Which is not a bad way to go, Tammy. Found with all that fudge. But bottom line is, take every day and make it work. Exercise every day. Eat right every day. Make love to your wife every day. <laughs> I <laughs> can I get an amen? <laughs> is that true? I'm doing a new musical in New York next year about a foot fat. If someone here has been to a fat form, it's called Pounds LBS period. And it's about 10 people, 10 overweight people who go to a fat farm to lose weight. And Dorothy Loud, what you got in your eye? Dorothy Loud is in it. And 
They might have to roll me there, y'all, if I ever win. Of an overweight person again. What I'm trying to do is make sure that everybody has a good life and that no one is put down for anything. That's We're all right. Nice children, and we all should be treated in a positive way. And manner. equal. Right? Yes. <laughs> Can I get an amen? <laughs> He's going to do it the whole hour. Tammy and I are going to be cooking. It'll just be us again. We're going to sing. We're going to do a wonderful thing. And Doug Oldham's going to sing right now. Jim Baker. Look. Look at, look at, look at, Tammy Faye. Is she precious, y'all? That poor baby. Just breaks my heart. go ahead and I'll try to upload another uh, part of the ABC uh, reaction to the ABC interview. I got sad when I was watching it so I was trying to get something happy in here because I reviewed the whole thing before I watch it with y'all. So just comment down below. I hope y'all enjoy this. Keisha Koo here signing out. Um, if you like this please subscribe. Please share. Thanks. Happy great day, Jesus, all along the way. <laughs>